majestic continental peak. Rising over 4,500 feet above Scottsdale, Carefree, and Cave Creek, it's the highest mountain in the area. But what's it like to be on top, beyond the double gates that guard it? It's a whole different world, reached by one of the most spectacular roads on the planet. This road climbing around rocky outcroppings as it goes higher and higher, even past pine trees, revealing a hidden world. An historic 40-acre parcel on a cliff. This rare patented land includes mineral rights and is surrounded by BLM property. This is where the gold came from. There's an entry tunnel bored into the bottom of the rich vein, honeycombed with tunnels all the way to the top. Views of Black Mountain and the entire Phoenix area spread out to the south with rugged cliffs, just above Charles Fleming's historic Fleming Springs. This land originally was settled by the Mormon pioneer family, the Steeles, who came here in a covered wagon. It's your own private world with a number of level building pads on the top and even a potential helipad. Cool, crisp air at 4,000 feet. There's rich quartz nodules loaded with gold ore on the top. A local museum even sends volunteers to get samples of the gold ore for stamp mill demonstrations. This is the road that travels down from the top. With evidence of the mining camps and a view to the Golden Reef Mine and the tram towers that transported the gold ore to the valley floor. The tunnels were used by a Hollywood film crew for a sci-fi movie. You know, there are more than 20 uses for old mine tunnels other than mining. Let's take a look inside. And if you listen closely, you can imagine the sounds of all the miners working the tunnels to extract the gold ore. How would you use the 40 acres of the last outpost? One of the most unusual and unique properties available. Thanks for coming along on our tour. Come back and see it in person.